Hi, um, today I've got one of these Kit Vision Monkey Grips. Uh, it's it's a cheap version of the Gorilla Pod. Um, I also have a Gorilla Pod, but I've got this for something else. Uh, basically, I just wanted this bit here um, for something else, but I thought I'd do a review since it's turned up today. Um, First thing is the legs aren't extendable, which is fine. It's a cheap item anyway. You've got this little adjuster here, uh, so you can adjust the angle of your uh, phone or camera. And then this has an adjustable neck. So you can slot your phone in here or your camera. Now, first thing I want to say is if you've got a GoPro, it doesn't fit. It does, it'll fall out and there's nothing holding it in. Okay, GoPro doesn't fit. Uh, Nokia Lumia. That doesn't fit. Okay, I know somebody's gonna make a comment. Oh, I'll take it out of the holder and it'll fit. Um, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't make any difference whatsoever. Let's take it out, just, just to prove a point. So, the reason I chose this one is it's about the same size as the uh, smaller Samsung phones. Um, so as you can see, it just doesn't fit. That's it maxed out. And it still still wants about another 10 millimeters before the, the Nokia will fit. Um, let's try my phone. I've got a Samsung Note, so you can see the difference in size. There's no hope of that fitting. So for me, it doesn't actually do what I wanted it to do. Um, I don't have a phone this small. Um, I think if you had a small uh, camera, uh, you know, the little pocket type, it'll fit in there. But even then I'm almost an R in because this might actually go across the buttons on the top of the camera. So I'm not sure. It's a cheap item. Um, you know I go on about buying quality. Well, this is a prime example of why not to bother because this is totally useless for what I want it for, but uh, might be useful for the kids somewhere. But I've got nothing that actually fits in this. I mean, that's a bizarre thing because when you read the box, uh, size, weight, camera interface, universal screw. So, well, this bit actually works and I'm not going to put my 650D on this, but you can actually fit um, a normal large camera, a DSL camera, a DL, DSLR camera on here. I've tried it, it fits on it, but I wouldn't trust it to hold my camera without damaging the lens by falling over. But the thread is a standard thread that fits most items, so you might find that okay that doesn't work for what you want it but if you can find an adapter to fit that then that's fine but i was actually just after this bit <laughs> to go on a boom um because we're going to be doing some cookery uh videos soon and having a getting the adapter that goes off a tripod with a long boom and then angling the camera so that you can actually work your hands um because when cooking, you don't need to see my face. You're interested in what I'm doing with my hands or what my wife's doing with my hands. So the boom mic uh, fitting with this on it was gonna actually do that job for us. Um, what's gonna happen now is I now have to buy another adapter, but a far more expensive one. But hey ho, lesson learned. Um, yeah, just double checking on here that it's got no dimensions to say the uh, capacity. See. Can you read that? Capacity, digital cameras and compact video camera. Uh, so it says it can take cameras, but that's a bit weird. Cause as it says here, it says mobile phones, but mobile phones don't fit. But I, I'm sure if you had like something like a Samsung, uh, mini or something like that it would fit but if you got something a bit like these phones which are more the modern smartphones that people are using more and more 
they just don't fit in the bracket. So it's something just to be aware of uh, before buying. Check with the guy selling either this product or another one that it actually fits the product you're going to put into it. Um, like I said, I just got it to because I only wanted this, the top piece, but it doesn't fit. Uh, thanks for watching.